so real talk, mm. this puzzle is dumb. Thankfully, cool. we won't have to put up with much of it. Hey cool. there, Dango Duo 999. Yay. How you doing? Welcome back. There's a note on the table. We're gonna read the note. Iron equals one. Mm. Salt equals two. Mm. Water equals three. Let me just grab one me. part iron, two part salt, three part water. Carbon dioxide equals oh, you have to combine them. Motherfucker. Uh, let me just double check that I do actually just dioxide have the and ammonia. And I almost, I'm almost feeling like this either a solves itself. Or you just uh, okay, you know notes? what? I ha I have notes here, so I will give them to you. Cool. Uh, yeah. What do you think this is a hint for? Uh, maybe it's got some something, something to do with this box. The box is locked. Uh, looks like you have to enter a passcode on the keypad, though. I can only enter three numbers. E is for enter and C is for clear. Once you input the number, press E. Blah blah blah. You know how this goes. Uh, let's give it a shot. Do you have any idea what this number could be? No, you don't. Don't you try- <laughs> You could have at least tried- <laughs> Now you have to clear. Yep, you did it! You did it, hold Kenny! On, hold on, Alright, well, yep. those are all my uh, You uh, did it! Now, you may want to uh, click on those bottles. You blue have the blue liquid! liquid. You also gonna need the other liquid. Looks like there's something inside that bottle! Why don't you try pouring some into cap? I uh, can't see any reason why not. What's well, Dad? It's bright blue. Do you think it's alien blood? Oh my god, you're dumb. Where the hell did that come from? Then what do you think it is, Seven? I don't know. Some sort of special bath soap. Oh, what a boring guess. All right, you got oh. the blue liquid. You should Time probably get also the get the red liquid, I assume. Oh yeah. fuck! You guessed it. Looks like there's something inside that bottle. If I want to pour some out into cap. Yeah, you know what? This it's... one's bright red. Do you think it's blood? No, blood's thicker than that. Then what is it? Oh, it beats me. Uh, there's also a bunch of uh, things around you you are going to want to investigate. Hey, Junpei, you think there are any slugs in this ship? Huh? Well, if there are, I was thinking we could put salt on them. What's she pointing at? The label states N-A-C-I. Oh, that's C-C-L. N-A-C-C-L. N-A-C-L. Salt, huh? Do you think Seven will shovel up if we put it on him? Hey, do you say something? I love they're all fall together, by the way. Mm -hmm. There's a bottle yeah, yeah, of salt and, and there. I, I know. I know chemistry. Jump in, there's a bottle of iron powder on the shelf. Uh, how do you know it's iron? The label says F-E. F-E yeah, fire stands emblem. for iron, right? Fire emblem. No, I'd be if the E was capitalized. Huh? Something stinks. Is it coming from this bottle? It's a, th this is the most, like, look at all these elements. Th uh, I think this room is one of the sealers rooms in the whole game, because they're like, what is this? Ooh, Let me, we all know the it. names. Oh, it's NH3. Oh. Sulfuric, sulfuric acid or something. Well, of course that stinks. It's ammonia. Oh, fucking ammonia. Yeah. Oh, good stuff. Let's go for a drink. Uh, what are you talking about? I'm talking about that bottle. It says C2H5OH, right? Uh, it's ethanol. That's right. It's also known as ethyl alcohol. It's pretty much what booze is made of. So, you're gonna drink it? Cool. Oh, um, maybe. Nah, I won't. It might say that's what's on the, what is on the label, but there could be anything in there. Hey, Dumpe. There's dihydrogen monoxide on shell. Uh, why don't you just say water? Huh. Uh, what's this? Looks like can with spray nozzle. It says CO2. So it's a can filled with carbon dioxide. Uh, did you read the note on the table? Yeah. Uh, can we read it again? It's a uh, one is uh. Uh, it's in the, the room. Oh, I have to click on the box. It's one is iron, uh, iron two is salt, salt, three is water. Mm -hmm. carbon, carbon dioxide. dioxide. Question. Ammonia. Question. Ethanol. Question. Carbon dioxide is CO2. I don't have any... Uh, I think uh, the question here, and I don't know how we get there, because I think... Oh, You're supposed to like, combine these, I assume, to make no, some, uh, 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 some no, sort of digital no, root no. combination. Uh, no, no, it's not. It's not. Oh. Uh, the thing... Okay, I, I feel like we're missing information. I have the answer right here, but we're missing information. It, it makes no sense for us to like... Oh. Oh, well, look at first line. Maybe question mark represents number. No shit, Sherlock. 
I think we're missing information, and you have clicked on all the walls. So yeah, let's I... go check another room. Okay. I have the solution right here, but it feels cheap to just be like, I just enter freaking like. Jimpe, where are you going? One, two, this is the end. This is the door we came. That's what we came through. Remember door. We don't need to tell you remember door. It's the one right here. Yeah, I was just saying that we should probably go the back way. Uh, uh, it's so awesome. Okay. <laughs> uh. So I guess we gotta go in here then. Junpei, you've spilled the vagoo all over the floor. Not the vagoo. Uh, let's see, um, a piece of paper. Uh, uh, what's this? Is this some kind of medical record? Is, is this like, the actual fucking, like, that would make so much sense. Uh, oh, you know what? No, 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 no. Uh, that, this looks oh. really important. Don't worry about it. The numbers on top of so you'll care about, and yeah. it will give it to you when you start the puzzle. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, two mannequins. Rooms. They both weigh different things yeah, because yeah, of yeah. reasons. There's nothing left. You want to place down to close I that. I know. I just habitually. habitually. Yeah. <sighs> what the hell are you doing? Don't you want to get out of here? But I'm tired. That would be me. Uh, there are four different lights, each one a different color. White, red, blue, and purple. Does this thing react to something? And then the lights light up? Uh, 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 do me a favor, mm -hmm. right now. Click on the light on the left side. Oh, well, this. Now, back out. Back out. Turn. Oh, uh, turn to the side. As you can see, there are four. There are three doors. Mm -hmm. first. Oh, was that supposed to be a sink? A I sink. guess. Doctors and nurses probably washed their hands before operation. Nothing suspicious here. Okay. So, you have doors that are closed, and there's a color in front of them. I wonder what that means. It won't open. It looks like it's locked. There's a red plate on it. Do you think that means something? You don't have to click on all the doors. <laughs> well, what do you think this means, Kenny? You can see on top, by the way. It shows you the, the screen with all the, the locks. Oh, hey, it turned red. Forget about that. Didn't you just hear that just now? I don't know if I could cleanse it for you, which I really oh, appreciate that. Oh, I was like... Oh, the leg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know if I want to hear all that. <laughs> you don't want to carry all that? N no, I mean, like, hear all them talking about the legs. Huh. It's blue now! I think I heard another noise. A bunch of them, like... Some of them are, like, really useful. Others are just kind of like, this is a leg! Yeah, exactly. That's why I'm like, yeah. yeah. This is another uh, leg. Yeah, and that's it. There's all we can do. There's absolutely nothing nothing else. I There's... know how colors work. Don't, patro <laughs> don't patronize me. <laughs> but if you want to patronize us, check out our Patreon page. Mm -hmm. Patreon.com slash do. You combine yeah, you... red and blue liquid yeah. to make purple. Sometimes it is a little patronizing. Good job, Jim Pei, The purple light came on. I heard it unlock. I'm sure it's unlocked now. The locker with the, the locker purple is no plate longer has got to be unlocked. Yeah. <laughs> so let's unlock the locker with the purple light plate. <laughs> you... Junpei, you... Oops. <laughs> Whatever. And that's a nose. <laughs> Definitely. It's a nose. No, it's a system. It's a okay. hips. Okay, alright, head out, tummy. head out. I have no clue how the f And you're done with this room, by the way. This is oh. also the, the exit. Oh. Oh, because it's that, yeah. that door? Yeah. Oh, cool. Uh, so you want to turn... Turn around, bright eye. No, 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 no. You want to... Oh. Back? That's confusing. Yeah, that, is, that is confusing. This layout is not very it's helpful. Not. And you want to go back to the chemical room. I don't know. I think you're supposed to just check until you get the freaking, like... You enter them in this order, the, or rather, I guess you're just supposed to kind of figure it out. Uh, just give it to the, me. The numbers, okay, uh, I'll explain to you. Mm -hmm. uh, it says iron is one, mm -hmm. salt is two, mm -hmm. hydrogen is three. Mm -hmm. That is, uh, they are arranged on the simplicity of their molecular form. Iron is just Fe. Mm -hmm. uh, and salt, salt is, is NaCi, which is two NACL. components. NaCl. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, and uh, hydro uh, water is H two O, which makes it three components. Yeah, yeah and, and uh, you wanna. Uh, 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 so that t that tells you like. Oh, so right, how many things are in one and one thing? Yeah. Okay, got it. The answer is two. Is a uh, four. Is a uh, three four nine. Right, it's how many things are in. Okay, yeah. that makes and sense ten. actually. Yeah, it takes a little while to get there, but yeah. Yeah. And there you go. You did it. You did it. Also, I love I'm actually gonna examine this. It's a heart. This thing is super creepy. That ain't. This is not good for heart. And I think are we gonna get the, are we gonna get the cutscene now? Yeah, yes, we yeah, are. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. You think we should go back? Uh, yeah, I think it's probably for the best. Oh wait, wait. Do you you see that? Oh, it's a it's a, it's a scene important for the plot. Mm. Uh, Clover not Clover noted and left. 
Junpei was about to follow her when he realized that Seven wasn't following suit. Uh, hey, uh, Seven, uh, what's up? Oh, well... He looked at, up at Junpei distractedly, and then back up at the brown bottle he, helped, uh, he held cupped in his large hands. Uh, what's that? In response, Seven tossed the bottle gently to Junpei. He caught it and twisted it around to read the label. Oh, yeah. Ethylene diamine tartrate? EDT. It's tartanic ethylamide. Ethyldemide. What kind of chem uh, what kind of medicine is this? It's not medicine. I think it's an industrial strength detergent. Why would they have something like that here? Well, probably to clean stuff up. Uh, clean what up? Fuck if I know. Still. It looks like it's cleaned my brain up. Junpei looked up from the bottle. Uh, you remember something? Seven huh. nodded slowly and spoke. Well, I remember the story about EDT. It happened around 50 years ago. I am not 50, so it's fine. There was this factory somewhere in America making big old, big old EDT crystals. They were making it to sell as industrial strength cleaner, like I told you before. But... All ready for the, th for the conspiracy theory song? A year after factory started up, Something strange started happening with crystals they were building. Water molecules started attaching themselves to EDT crystals. Didn't we? Wasn't in one of the routes we had some kind of? It was the it was the freezer room where we were talking about some kind of oh, yeah. molecular. You they talked about water. about uh, ice. No no ice, no uh, no! It was some kind of water that. Yeah, uh, a, a, a type of ice that would, that only melted at ninety six degrees. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I uh, it's called sure. ice nine. Oh yeah. What the, oh yeah, this made them into sort of mutation of original crystals called hydrate. Once the crystals turn into hydrate, though, it's useless as cleaner. The factory just had to dump crystals as hydrate because they were useless. But it did not end there. After that day, same thing started to happen to in... Oh yeah, 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 I remember this. Something like this. Something... Oh yeah, no ice started f forming everywhere. Uh, happening in EDT factories everywhere. Even ones nowhere near that first American factory. They've been making crystals the same way, with the same materials and the same equipment and environment. But now, all of a sudden, every single crystal they form turned into hydrate. In fact, ever since that day, no factory has ever been able to pure EDT crystal. Even in EDT research done years before, they'd never gotten hydrate. But after it happened in that first factory, it just spread. It was like, man, how, how do you say? You mean like, it was infected with a virus or something? Zombie shook his uh, zombie. Mm. <laughs> Seven. I was gonna make a joke like like zombie. zombie. Bird, yes, yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Seven shook his head. No, not like that. It spread like wildfire. It showed up in labs that were completely isolated from rest of the world. It even started happening to crystals that were completely sealed up. It doesn't seem like it could have been a result of stuff coming in contact with other samples. Then. Uh... Well, I'd guess it was some sort of information. Like the crystals were transmitting this information all across the world somehow. What information? How to make a new crystal. Something had to tell the stuff how to do it, right? Like it just whispered into the EDT and tank. Hey, if you do this, you can take in water molecules. Come on, man. Th th that's just... I mean, who's this someone anyway? Someone you can't see. Someone who exists all over the world. Like... You mean god. like a, a god? Kamisama? Or maybe the devil. Seven grand. <laughs> As Junpei was trying to figure out what on earth he was trying to say, he was gonna say next, Clover's shrill voice pierced the room. Hey! What are you two doing over there? Are you guys making out? Stop wasting time and get over here! Okay, okay, we're coming. We already came, it's fine. Uh, uh, also, like, I, I love what you can see, like, how awful these last nine years have been on fucking Seven. Mm hmm. Because you see him young and then, like. Oh, I know, poor guy. Yeah, poor guy. Jeez! Seven looked at Junpei. Yeah, so anyway, that's the story. It might be useful someday. Don't forget it. Yeah, probably won't. With that cryptic remark, he turned and left the room. Mm, mm, mm. I'm sure this doesn't matter at all. Junpei was left behind to ponder what he had just heard. Hmm. Ice that, nev that only freezes at certain temperature. And things that turn the taken water molecules. He must be a thing. Oh, you know what? I bet this is this is about 
the flat earth theory. Mm, that makes sense now. <laughs> Information being transmitted, transmitted invisibly. Could such a thing really happen? Yeah. Well, thinking about that crap isn't going to help me right now. We need to figure out how to get the hell out of here first. He took a deep breath, tried to clear his mind, and followed after seven. Excuse me. Okay. All right, and now you have all the pieces of uh, Exodia. Of uh, Lucy. You can just click on one. Uh, no, no. I, okay. I think you should just. This should just launch it. Just click on it. This bed doesn't look very comfortable. Okay. Do me a favor. Oh wait. Okay. Uh, so we've collected the six parts of the medical mannequin. So the one we. Mo so the ones we have got must be for Lucy, right? Yeah. Seems like it. Well, I say we give Lucy her parts back. Any objections? Nope. Agreed. Alright, uh, let's get started. Combine! Form of... Lucy. Hey, nothing happened. That's odd. Maybe it's the wrong weight? Weight? Yeah, like, like you know, like those are unrealistic expectations of, of you know, female uh, beauty. Mm -hmm. uh, well, you know how there's a scale on the side of the bed? Maybe we need to get the scale to a specific number. How are we gonna? Oh. How are we going to do that? I think we're supposed to swap her body parts with John's. What? Oh. Uh, let's give it a shot. Okay, now I just click through this. You click on one part, then the one you want to swatch, swatch to. Yes, switch to. Can I? Can I look at how how weighted they uh, are? Ah, oh, thank you. That's. Oh. Oh, so actually. you can't move those and. Okay. Um, yeah. You can move. Uh, yeah. I don't. You can't. You can't move the chest, by the way. And you want her to be 61? Oh, no, wait, go back. I thought they wanted to be equal. Oh, no, 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 no. He has to be one weight and she has to be another. Oh, what's the... Uh, I... The weight she has to be... I don't have it on hand, but if you literally just change, like, one part of the chest, you should be fine. No, not the heart, the chest, the actual chest. I did that. Uh, the bottom chest? And then, like, one leg. Because she's supposed to be 61 something. The other leg? She's supposed to be heavier? Oh. There you go. You, you have to exchange all the parts. Kitty, then. you did it. That's silly. Hey, Junpei, I just heard something. It came from John's operating table. We better check it out. So you have to exchange all the parts except for the heart yeah. and the two. I wonder what the, like, is it supposed to be, like, I don't know. Like, why did you change the parts of these two different, differently gender individuals? I don't know. I don't know. You want to click on the box, Kitty? Oh. <gasps> uh-huh. Uh, the lid on the scale. Uh. Oh, we got a key. Uh, it opened. Oh, uh, I get it. Uh, it must have opened because we matched John's weight with, to what's on the chart. Jupiter. Uh, that's the Jupiter key. We did it. Yeah, it's got the freaking... It's Jupiter. The best Juni scout. Freaking Juniper, uh, best uh, freaking professor. Can I leave now? Yeah, just, you're, you're done. Which way is leaving? You want to go to the left, into the, draw, into the color room, all the way to the back, and then there you go. See, it even has the little symbol on it. Oh, I didn't... Hey, hold on. Uh, Junpei stopped, ab about to put the key into the doorknob. Uh, what's up? Where's Clover? Huh? Junpei turned around. This motherfucker's grabbing another axe, goddammit, lady. Clover was nowhere to be seen. God damn it! Uh, where the hell did she go? Ugh, arg. Okay, just hold on a minute. Uh, I'll go get her. Sure thing. Maybe both of us should go? Junpei left Seven at the door and headed back to the operating room. He found her standing next to the operating table. She was standing, staring at the mannequin. Uh, hey, Clover, uh, what's wrong? W what's with this another story scene? Mm. Come on, uh, let's get out of here. Mm. She didn't respond. If she hadn't been standing up and breathing, Junpei might have thought she was dead. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, did you want to come back here and say goodbye to John? We'll finish this scene and then call it an episode. Phone, stop vibrating. There you go. <laughs> Uh, it, it wasn't the best joke, but it was something, an, something, an attempt to lighten the mood. Clover didn't laugh, though. It was a bad joke. She stood stuck still and said nothing. Uh, hey, uh, Clover, uh, can you hear me? No. Perhaps it was something he had said, or perhaps it was something else. At this point, does she know her brother is dead? No, no she doesn't yet, huh? No. Suddenly, not. her mouth opened, and she whispered in a dry, dead voice, my brother, he might be dead. Huh? Uh, huh? 
That's why we couldn't find him. If he's dead, I'm going to be next. Suddenly, the operating room felt very, very cold. Uh, uh, what are you talking about? Uh, what's wrong with you? He gave her a small shake, but she still didn't respond. The silence grew heavier. Uh, let's just get out of here. We've got the key. Let's use it. Uh, the, that that cool with you? Yeah, we cool. Clover nodded almost imperceptibly. Still, Junpei was glad to see she was at least somewhat responsive. J Junpei, please double check that she doesn't have a freaking axe in her jacket. Mm -hmm. He put his hand on her shoulder and guided her to the preparation room. As they arrived at the door, she suddenly stopped. I'm sorry. What was this? Why was she apologizing? Junpei wasn't sure what to make of her. Was she emotionally unstable because her brother had gone missing? I'm really sorry. Just forget everything I told you, okay? Don't worry about it. Really, I mean it. How could anyone pretend not to hear something like that? But something told him this wasn't the time to press the issue. Junpei gave her the warmest, kindest smile he could manage. Uh, uh, Alright. Thank you. Her smile was weak, it was almost painful to watch. Enough of that bullshit. Damn. What the hell took you guys so long? Seven looked up as they walked into the room, clearly irritated. You playing doctor in there or some shit? <laughs> playing doctor. Oh, you're funny. Uh, uh, m maybe. Uh, jealous? Well, jealous of me tapping this clearly underage girl? Ew. Th thanks, boys. Thanks, boys, for making this gross. Mm -hmm. Seven avoided answering the question. Yeah, this is the perfect time to bang mm. in the middle. I mean, I mean, it makes. If it was June, it would be completely okay. Mm. It would make more sense. But not Clover. No. They stood in front of the door. Junpei took out the, ju the juniper key. Close enough. Best, best, best professor. Well, yeah. All right, I'm gonna. All right, I'm gonna open it now. Uh, is that cool? You don't need to keep asking. Just do it. All right. Uh, uh, fine then. That's what she said. He slid the key into the keyhole That's and turned said. it. Kingdom Hearts! I was, gonna, I was about to say that! Oh my god, he felt that unlock. <gasps> Kitty! Kitty! We did it! Oh, <laughs> the door opened with a soft melancholy creak. Oh, my bones! Beyond it lay a simple white hallway. There was no fanfare or confetti. No, I want the confetti! Obviously, there was no one there to applaud them. God damn it! They simply walked through the door. That was it. Uh, Alright, uh, let's get going. Hey man, what's up? Did I just hear my cat? No. Oh. I didn't hear him. Okay. Uh, hey man, what's up with you? You're so serious, you know? Can't you sound more happy? You know, get a little excited? Um... Yeah? Not really. You Junpe are a stupid, you know, party pooper, you know that? Junpei, oh, Junpei turned away and he walked out. And, and the word echoing in the back of his hmm. mind. My brother might be dead. dead, dead, dead. I'm going to be next. Clover had told him only a few minutes before that her brother was simply was probably dead, and she was likely to follow him. Oh. How could he pretend to be happy after hearing something like that? Oh, if you don't like Clover, then you, you found, found it. <laughs> <coughs> All right, Dango Duo, you know what's up, yep. Kitty, Kitty, Kitty. What are you doing, Kitty? Kitty, look at the look at the screen, Kitty. Oh, oops, sorry. I, it, it went up there on its own. <laughs> Thank you for dangling along with Dango Duo. We'll see you in the next episode. Tag along. We have a bunch of shit to flash forward, but first we have to catch up with this. Until then, see you, huh? Next time! Next time. Step, 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 step.